frog. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, in that Technicolor rainbow in between is your boy Trey Proper. This is your boy Big Herman. He doesn't know how to hold that wad. Hold that yeah. wad. That's, and if you look on camera, then you'll see why. They can't see this oh, part. I was <laughs> off camera doing this. So I... The drink for today. <laughs> the drink of the day is Corona, and it's still coming out of the damn bottle. He I was off camera, no, and I was moving so fast, I didn't realize. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me let me see if I can catch wow. it. Up. Yeah, uh, go ahead. No, what that mouth do? What that mouth do? Come on, suck it out. Y'all can't see nothing. What that mouth do? But in celebration of Cinco of Cinco de Mayo, <laughs> we are drinking Corona Premier. Oh, and by the way, it's perfectly balanced. Oh, my goodness. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but, yeah, we did want to uh, definitely get a – we had to celebrate the day because, you know, our day is the 5th and fell on the 5th. Uh, but for those of you who are not aware, Cinco de Mayo is actually the celebration of when the Mexican Army beat the French Army and the Battle of Puebla. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. all right. Did I say it right? Okay, all right. Back in 1868. Uh, so that's it. Happy single tomorrow. We're not going to go all crazy and start making crazy noises and stuff like that. No, like not that. crazy, I but. I couldn't help it. <laughs> my name's Jeff. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Nobody here is Hispanic. <laughs> <laughs> so we just want to say happy I, single tomorrow. I ate a bitch in a chunk with one. She's like, chunk <laughs> Oh, shit. So, <laughs> the second portion of the show, we want to introduce our special guest. <laughs> <laughs> Closet Fly Deli. How's it going? Closet Fly Ella DeVille. Closet Fly Ella You can Ella only find me on Instagram. Hello. Hi. This is one of our close personal friends of the Hi. show. Yeah. So. And today's token day. Glad to be yes. here. Also, we will be uh, we will be celebrating uh, Pride Month as yeah. it is May. Yeah. We'll be getting yeah. into that later as well. Yeah. So, but first off, uh, let's get into those church announcements. Well, actually, yeah. what about the square jar? Oh, oh, oh yeah. So yeah, yeah. we're going to continue the swear jar. I'm not sure if the things are above my head or not. Yeah. Last week, uh, we, we started a tradition where we actually cut down on our profanity. Have I cursed yet so far? Yes, you have. Did I curse? No. Not you know, in this show, no. No, not during oh, the show. Yeah, no. of course I cursed before the show. Yeah, no. yeah. Sure, yeah. So, oh, oh, definitely. Oh, really? Yes. Really? Yes. That's what you're we're talking. doing? <laughs> we're singling me out? That's what we're doing. Oh, okay. Definitely. That's fine. That's so fine. we're going to keep the counters up above our heads uh, as we continue to donate uh, for autism. And last week, I won. Yeah. So well, how do you say? I win, I win, I win. <laughs> yeah, that's shit stuff. <laughs> oh, what'd you say? I said stuff. I called oh, it. Oh, you said all you said. I said sh you, stuff. No, you didn't. You just, we heard, I heard we it. We can do a live I poll. heard it. <laughs> heard but, it. Uh, so, so, far, heard it. <laughs> so far for the last shows, the tally is 13 his way, 9 my way. So that's $13 he got all he got to offer up, 9 I got to offer up. We're going to see how this goes at the end of the show. Yeah. Uh, but we will continue to do this in perpetuity. And now you can do your church announcements. Yeah, we're going to get into those church announcements. As you guys know, Beer, Bourbon, and Barbecue will be taking place at the National Harbor, D.C. Uh, D I'm sorry, D.C.'s National Harbor. Uh, noon at 2 o'clock, there's the uh, VIP Beast Mode session, which is $75. Then you have the 2 to 6 general admission uh, prices. That's uh, $40. If you have any questions about that, you can go on to beerandbourbon.com. There's the Call of Thrones taking place on the DuPont Circle. Uh, that is going to be Saturday, May 25th from 2 to 10 p.m. Uh, yeah, he's, he's, I'm excited. Yeah, he's, <laughs> yeah, he is very excited. Uh, then, <laughs> then we have on July 12th through the 14th, you have BlurCon taking place at the Hyatt Regency, Cap Crystal City, Virginia. Full weekend passes are $55. You can go on BlurCon.com to go on for, for more details. Also, I got it right this time, so I, I just did my study and know how to pronounce this. Okay. So we will be watching, and feel free to join us uh, to go and see the uh, new Spider-Man Far From Home on July the 6th at Next Act Cinema on 9, at, at 921 Reister Town. There you go. <laughs> Good job. Good job. <laughs> Pikesville, Maryland, uh, 21208. And also, we have merchandise, merchandise now. So, yes, you can go and have 
your own version of Blurs and Whiskey. With the spirit uh, fingers. Yeah. <laughs> the spirit fingers. Vanna Black. on the other side, you have, come get this shot. Tell there you take go. Take shot. And we Sorry. have a variety of different things on there. Still waiting on those beard pics. Speaking of beard, you see how fresh your boy looks. I told you I was looking kind of rough last time. He finally you know. got better cameras, and now he's... he's I wasn't going to show up here looking scruffy and again. I, and, I, and, and I'm... Give credit when credit Thank you. Now. Thank you. I appreciate <laughs> it. But also, you can go and get all your uh, merchandise on uh, teespring.com slash stores slash fighting dash spirit dash merchandise. Or Pick you can just go on to... the link on the link. Click on the link. It's on there, but yeah. Or you can go on our uh, IG pages mm-hmm. on, our, uh, on uh, Trey Proffers. Or Beto's way, or you can go on uh, Blurs and Whiskey. Uh, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. And go don't pay and take it from me. Don't pay yeah, don't pay no mind. <laughs> this is our show. We're just visiting. Um, but yeah, yeah. I mean, oh hey. Oh the shade. This doesn't count, right? This shade. No, no. no. You are oh, not, yeah. you're not in it. You're not. No, I said I wanted she to. Said be. She said, "Oh, I'm playing." Okay, so we made that agreement. Well, hold on a second. Okay. If that if that counts, if that does not count, well, she's already got one. No, how? Well, What's yeah. the first one? I don't remember. I don't think. No, but I'm saying she, she if that if... word when we were talking about single de Mayo. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. she did. Eat. I did, yeah. But, yeah. Chocla. Oh, there you Chocla. Go. but, but you right. said as far as um putting up the middle finger, that does, doesn't does count. Does that count? I, I, mean, no. I mean, y'all been doing it off screen. We've been doing it off screen. So I mean, I feel like All right, I so can you got go two. ahead and say. Oh come on! No, 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 if, if, I, do if, if I verbal, if I verbal, verbal, all right, verbal. Okay. okay. So I can so, do this for the rest of the show. And I can do yes. this because I got cue cards now. So yeah, pimp the sips them. <laughs> oh, <sorry>. oh no. <laughs> yes. Hey. I win. I win because I haven't cursed yet. <laughs> He's provoking you. Yeah. Oh, man. Man. What what are you go ahead. Go on. That? You guys, you feel oh. like you need to say something? You Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> that deserves one. That deserves one. Early in the beginning. My. Okay. I can't. Oh man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what do they say? Moving when, on. When, <laughs> what are we doing? When they go high, <laughs> I go lower. So. I don't think that's what Michelle was saying. No, that's not how it goes. I'm sorry. That ain't what she said. <laughs> okay, so see now. I, he didn't tell me about that. Yes, I didn't, and I he purposely totally... left it for the show. <laughs> so, <laughs> if you could just see the look on us. <laughs> oh, camera oh, guy's oh, face is priceless. <laughs> my face is probably priceless. Oh, man. Are oh, you, yeah. I, that, okay, mm-hmm. all right, let's so focus. We're going to move on. Let's focus. Yes, let's so, right. <laughs> uh, Redirect. Re- recontaining <laughs> myself. Uh-huh. You got one out of me, so we all at one right Well, he ain't at right one. Right now, <laughs> Trey is my... <laughs> So we thank you guys for joining us here on Blurs and Whiskey. <laughs> this will be our final show. <laughs> it, it might be the finale. God. Oh man, it is appropriate. Oh, so it's, it's cool. But I'm never coming back now. <laughs> <laughs> so and, and oh. people in the comments, so let's check out these. Oh comments. man, <laughs> <laughs> Nicole oh. Carter is yet again throwing shade. I'm just gonna tune oh. her out. Uh, <laughs> Who was that? Okay, so I'm gonna I'm put Marcus on the next week because apparently <laughs> it's not. Uh, but uh, yes, I'll just say B word. So I, I'll say whatever the words are. He really, uh, I won't say the words, but his I will mama didn't even had a right forethought now. to put Sharpie on it so y'all can see well, it. I mean, hey, Trey is my. So you just go cover up so, the yes, whole camera. I am. I'm going it's to go in. I'm show. going to. They win. didn't come here to read. I come to win. You don't have church announcements. Necessary. Yeah, don't we're doing church. <laughs> you SOB. What are we doing next? I can't deal with y'all. Oh, man. So I was excited before all this because we were going to talk about Game of Thrones final season episode three. And mm-hmm. that, how'd you feel about it? Arya. Mm-hmm. Hold on a second. Uh, my mom, she's on season five, episode two. So I'm not going to really, mom, just put it on mute. So you get to see our voices. I'm gonna give you like that little three second period right about now. It's what you see. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> this is this is when we get round into the nitty gritty. Oh uh, it was the the, I'm still the battle. Cards. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> it was the battle. The battle was epic in my opinion. Uh, the only reason why I really was kind of like 
Oh my God! Was was like my only gripe about it was that they weren't all in. It was dark outside, but it played tune when they went into the dark with the uh, mm-hmm. flames, and then all of a sudden it went pitch black. So. Leroy. <laughs> <James>. <laughs> but other than that, man, Arya is the MVP. I thoroughly enjoyed this. Uh, the memes from all of this was yeah. highly entertaining. Uh, yeah, even with the Damian Lillard uh, <laughs> with Arya's face was probably my yes. favorite. <laughs> yes. But yeah, it definitely was. A, it was Arya a great said, show. "I'm going out a woman." Okay, <laughs> that was my part. Okay, I did see that. She got it. She got it. She was in. like, yeah. "Yeah." She got her weapon. Okay. She got a pipe laid. <laughs> okay. Huh. And she get she that. That is a true. Shot. That's a true testament to yeah. if you getting it good. You just prosper in life. You can do but I don't even think she's she like a bust. She didn't even really just, but She's she, a faceless woman. But you know woman. what? She did it on her terms. It's one thing. Like, like okay, okay but y'all but ever had some? Well, here, damn, take it, pussy. You ever had that? Mm, you don't want that. Don't Does want that go on the counter? Yes. Yes. Does it? Yes. yes. You oh, come on. Word. You said the oh, key word. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> it's different because she was like, you know, she took control of the situation and she got it on her own terms. So it's that's totally different. If a woman gives it to you. It's not as fun yeah. if she just gives it. But mm-hmm. if she's like, that's my meaning, meaning like, to... like how she was, she was very in control of the situation. I think it's a little hot. It's a little hot. Right? Exactly. Little hot. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm sorry. You were saying no, no. no. You, I mean, I was saying Podrick pa- probably would have been a better choice for her. But I mean, Podrick. I mean, the, the, the dude. Oh yeah, I don't know who Padraic, that is yet. I don't know who so, that is. So yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, but y'all who watch the show, okay. Podrick puts it down. <laughs> yeah, he, he, He's called he, Podrick he, Panty Dropping Pain. Yeah. So, so like, yeah, because I mean he, he literally he hit the 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 is the W word uh, still wrong? Uh, the, Which the W word? The, I was gonna say what w- word is H- that? W. Um, you don't have a cue card for that? Don't have a cue card for that one. You Oh, you fatty! Seems like you weren't properly prepared. Prostitutes basically told him, "No, we don't need your money. We had fun. You can have your money." We would yes. love to do this again. Yes. Podrick probably would have been a better choice for her, but, but I mean, she had no, she had she no, had no this, history with yeah, Podrick. She, she had but the, the memes that originally initiated started from episode two was that when she when she had uh, relations with uh, she relations. got they, the, they can't see it. <laughs> Somebody get his man a sharpie. It's her <laughs> yes. So she lost her virginity it's to her uh, to uh, what's his name. Yeah. I forgot his name. Yes, moving on. Anyway, okay, yes. but yeah, but the memes were making it seem yeah. like she didn't enjoy it. But I call him old blacksmith mo, <laughs> old blacksmith mo. <laughs> but, but yeah, so if you guys are excited, is as excited as I am, uh, it's uh, you know it's a great show. Definitely give it a chance. Give it a look. Uh, let's check some of these comments. Uh, what's the name? <laughs> say it. Say it. Say it. <laughs> what's up, fam? Uh, yeah, so my cousin from Can- uh, California is watching us. Uh, Shanika Aaron, Aaron. Uh, yeah, my cousin, good to see you. Uh, who else? My mom um, says she thinks my, written words should count. No, oh. no. Your son decided to say that this didn't count, so. I didn't say that. Oh, you didn't say we that were saying, didn't count? We were saying the middle finger didn't count. We didn't say anything about written words. Mm. Mm. So, can we do a live poll of that? Can we do a live <laughs> poll of that? Should Sorry. written yeah. words count in the. No, it doesn't no? count. No? Oh. Anyway. It doesn't right. count. So, um. <laughs> Change the switching gears a little bit, so we're also moving on to uh, the unfortunate news that we heard this week that John Singleton yeah. passed. He's a very prolific director, executive producer, mm-hmm. father of seven. I was surprised to find that out about this I didn't guy. know that either. Had seven that. kids. I'm not going to list all their names. We ain't got that much time. Yeah. <laughs> but, didn't uh, believe in condoms at all. Uh, yeah. Oh wow! Uh, that's I, not I don't think that's the thing. I don't know. Uh, that's wow. a little too soon. Wow. <laughs> it's yeah, a little too soon to say that. I'm just, just, just wow. a lot of kids. I mean, it's uh, a lot. I mean, goodness gracious! I, mean, I was getting it in, but I'm, I mean, I'm the oldest of 21, so I am not here to judge anybody doing anything. No, yeah. I mean, I'm not judging them at all. I mean, as far as my man was getting it in. So, I mean, it was a little judgy. It was a little judgy. It was a little judgy. I don't like the fact that he wasn't. But he was purple like this. <laughs> Still in my bit. Okay. You don't say. Burn. But John Day, John Daniel Singleton was uh, born February second, nineteen sixty eight. He passed away in uh, 
uh, on the 29th of this of uh, last month. Last month. Mm-hmm. And you know, he survived by seven children. I'm sorry, I was doing stuff off camera. Uh, but yeah, he 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 passed away of a, of a he had a massive stroke and also needed a heart attack, and I'm sorry, it got stuck. There, it keeps getting stuck on the screen. Right there, that's fine. Just wow. stop. There you go. Sorry, sorry. Tech, we're having technical difficulties. <laughs> As we're always, not, every, sorry week, for the every week, every week. But you guys but, have cinnamon toast crunch. Yes, uh, she had her own <laughs> okay. cinnamon toast crunch, ladies and gentlemen. She's a skinny uh, fat. Fat. I didn't say oh, it. Oh, he's almost fat. said it. I almost said it. <laughs> okay. I almost said it. You waiting for the? You gonna get me? I'm, you know what I'm making a solemn swear. You ain't getting me no more. Yeah. So. But we wanted to open up the phone lines to you guys, so you know that number to call. What's that number to call? That number is four four three. Three, three seven, seven four one. one. <laughs> <laughs> he messed up this time. Yeah, I, messed up this. I only did that because I forgot it. I, we didn't do calls so, last yeah, week, and we, I totally forgot. Uh, so so <laughs> we're gonna open up the phone call lines now, <laughs> and uh, you guys give us a call. Let tell us what your favorite John Singleton movie was. Yes. Uh, uh, give us your we, favorite. We'll drink to that. Yeah, yeah uh, we'll definitely also, drink to that. Drink to that. And, but uh, uh, I have to say, I didn't really have a one uh, movie, but in particular, I had five. Uh, mines are uh, going from five all the way to one. Four Brothers was uh, number oh, five yeah. for me. That was a great movie with Tyrese. Uh, what's his name? Um, Andre Two Thousand and yep. uh, yeah, more. Shes- I forgot more. Shes- more was in it. Uh, Poetic Justice with Janet Jackson and Tupac That's at number favorite. four. Mm-hmm. Baby Boy, which I think was probably Baby the Boy most was my favorite. entertaining Baby one. Baby Boy was <laughs> my favorite one. <laughs> Look, <laughs> Jody. I mean, <laughs> Jody. Jody, Jody by Jody. <laughs> Best part of that movie. <laughs> just just the, across just the room. Across the room. <laughs> With your mom. When, when, when he walks in the <laughs> bathroom. Well, when he walks in the kitchen, they don't see nothing. You want some eggs? Just, you want some eggs? Some eggs? <laughs> he drinking a Kool-Aid like, like Joe, if you don't know what we're talking about, are you too young to be watching the podcast? <laughs> <laughs> Number two is higher learning. Mm-hmm. Uh, I thought the cast <laughs> on that whole entire movie was phenomenal. Yes. I mean, you, you had from. Um, Ice Cube to, uh, what's his name, Busta Rhymes. You had, uh, what's his name, Omar Epps in there. Mm-hmm. You had, um, what's, what's my man's name, uh, Remy. Um, uh, the white boy. The, uh, what oh, 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 I forgot his name. Um, is, that, is it Michael Rappaport? Michael, Ra- Michael Rappaport was yeah. in it. Uh, even, a, a thing I didn't even realize until earlier before the show that we were talking about, um, the guy who was the head of the skinheads in... Uh, okay. Higher Learning was also the bad guy in Too Fast, Too Furious, mm-hmm. who was also written, uh, was also directed by John Singleton. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But obviously, everybody knows, if you're not looking at the show, looking at the Easter egg, Boys in the Hood was my favorite uh, John, Sing- John Singleton movie. Yeah. Um, but one thing they he... don't know, they don't show, <laughs> or they don't give a you-know-what about the hood. Anyway, <laughs> but he was he was very. Uh, <laughs> it just got deep for no reason. It, did. Like, it just no, got it real deep. What, it was a so powerful line. Are, Did you get a hug? Yes. I, I, oh. Oh, Hold up. Goodness. Can we talk about John Singleton and how he? <laughs> not only did he empower. Ricky! <laughs> what? He you was, were saying he was empowering black men on mm-hmm. all ends of the spectrum. Yes, yeah. yes. Single fathers, yes. deadbeat dads, mm-hmm. encouraging yeah. them to be fathers, yes. Yes. co-parenting fathers. Yes, definitely. Uh, kids on the street growing up who've yeah. seen a bunch of stuff. Kids who just got transplanted to that community. Who just mm-hmm. got out the, first, uh, of all, uh, first of all, uh, boys in the hood. Yeah, didn't he talk about gentrification? His father's in name, the, he was talking about oh, yeah. gentrification yeah. back then. Yeah. Yeah. And the, the father's hood. name, Lawrence Fishburne's character's name was Furious Styles. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, so you got the man, you got the hip hop influence, and you know he loved Tupac to death. So mm-hmm. yeah, it was it was it's nuts. Yeah. So he, what he, was your he favorite? Was uh, there for us. What was your favorite John Singleton movie? Uh, Poetic Justice. Poetic Justice was Most my favorite. Most definitely. Cousin. Little lucky. Little lucky. Yeah. So that whole movie Most was just. Uh, I'm, I'm a I'm a sucker for I'm a sucker for. Uh, romantic, romantic uh, Com- comedies, rom coms. That was a hood rom. It was a hood rom. It was a hood rom. So, yeah. oh, you you the first. I, said, oh, I got one more thing. That the I first. Say, though. But you getting your uh, fresh shables and everything. You ain't got your brush like uh, look no, like home no, 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 Just yeah. Just go ahead. And just... It's more focus on. Yeah, it's more <laughs> on that. So I'm waiting to get my blurs and whiskey picked. That's what I'm waiting for. But, uh, <laughs> but we that do want to. Does not shaving count for having a beard too? 
Do I have a beard too? I can have a beard right now. Wait, girl. It's just, it's just not up here. What? This is. Nah, because these get displayed in public. Exactly. Well, look. Well, look. We, we can walk well, around with these beards. Hold well, up. up. Hold up. Well, look. Hold up. I was, I was just asking. I'm, I, I don't mean, know. I just, I'm, no. I've never want to wow, see that beard. Oh, man. No. I mean, angry angry you want to call them beards. Angry, angry beavers. beavers. Yep. Yep. That's about angry right. Angry That's about right. Angry beavers. do 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 Sorry. Back to John Singleton. Yeah, sorry. Back to uh, John We want to take I'm a sorry. moment to take a shout out oh, okay. to John. And there we go. <laughs> thank right. you for all the memories, the great yes. movies, and all that you've done for our community. Yes. yes. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Angry Beaver. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Okay, next. On the agenda. Go ahead. And go ahead. phone lines are still open if you want to join in the conversation. Okay. Uh, Don't ask me about my beard, though. That's not that's not what you're calling it's in off to the do. Rails that's already. not what we're doing. This go ahead. Sideways. What's, what's next? Thank you. Thank this you. is why they invited me, yes. so I'm sorry. <laughs> so are you expecting a PG, more 13-ish oh, right. thing? Oh, no. Okay. Oh, All right, no. good. So let's uh, get into some of these comments real okay. quick before we go to the next one. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, Ma Dukes uh, says that her favorite uh, poetic justice. You uh, ain't buff. <laughs> <laughs> Ebony Wiggins says uh, Boys in the Hood. Mm -hmm. Likewise. Oh, yeah. Ricky! Yeah, that, that hurt. That hurt my soul. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, uh, we even. Uh, did you put it on? Yeah, it's on. Oh, yeah, they can call in, yeah. Um, yeah 443 371. Four, four, 3155. Got it this time. Yep. So. <laughs> yeah. um, it's her first time seeing it. It's her first time seeing it. That was great. In unison and everything. You guys were fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate it. No, that. literally. Yeah, no. I, hey, I bought tickets. Uh, we appreciate that. Yeah, we got tickets. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, uh, so, uh, as of, as some of you know, if you tuned in after the show last week, I had talked so much trash about playing Mortal Kombat 11, and it I got honestly so many L's. At least more than more than I took. So I mean, I, 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 I lost to more I, people, yes, but between yeah, me and him, yeah, yeah, yeah. I lost twice to him. He um, lost twice to me. Yeah. So by your logic, I win. I win. Yeah, no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> you you beat most, everybody. I got the most, yeah, got the most W's. You got to beat everybody else, everybody but you only beat me the these, same amount of times. So you know what I'm saying? These, All right, this is what we're going to do. Hey, so since we played. Time, so we may, as well, we may as well plug Childish Games. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Childish yeah, Games came in. They're going to have to run it back. Oh, yeah. They're going to have to run it back. So it was around Robbins, and him and Childish Games, a Twitch player who plays online, you know, he on YouTube. I'm sorry. He. They were tied pretty much for the championship. I won twice against Herb. He won twice against me. So between me and him, it's deadlock. So he with that said, it's not. It's excuse me. No, with that said, nobody's tripping. It's over cool. Him. It's cool. I got something for you though. Yeah, that yeah. Street Fighter though. Well, you that got Street Fighter. I said that Street Fighter. <laughs> I'm about to hand you your behind. <laughs> I'm about to expeditiously. <laughs> we are getting, getting a call. Yes, yeah, sir. You are live with Blurs and Whiskey. What's up, boy? Cam, what's going on? What's going on, Cam? Hey, hey, hey what's going? Hey, everybody. Just wanted to say, um, yes, written words do count, Herb. Oh. No, it doesn't. Oh. We didn't put that logic into oh. it. Can, can we do we a live shake, poll? Oh, nope, nope. We didn't shake on it. Hey, Cam, Cam said, oh, Cam said last week we didn't oh, okay. shake on it, so it's not, it's not in there. So hey, I win. <laughs> so since it's too late to do a live poll you in the comments. No poll looking. Hey, <laughs> no, 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 no. I just want to tell her that you're wrong. Well, live I'm on there. I'm not wrong. I agree. <laughs> so, I agree. So if you feel as though him using his cue cards for cursing is him trying to find a loophole, in the comments, let us know. And we'll that count should the count. Comments. If, if the written get, words should count. Don't count. Yeah. <laughs> Production note. These aren't cue cards. Look, They're cut out. Let me down one for cue cards. All right, I'm out. All right, Cam. Oh, all right. Cam. Take it easy, Cam. All cameras, all camera guys oh, said production note. These, these are cue cards. cards. He, he doesn't just, have actual index it's, cards. It's arts and crafts. <laughs> doesn't matter. I it's still, arts it's, and crafts. Can you, how all right, all right I'm a curse for this one. I'm a curse. You can imagine his big ass sitting at home with a little piece of scissors. <laughs> cutting Same out the scissors. Paper. Same these scissors. I'm going to get Trey this time. <laughs> 
Oh man. If you'll take your ass yeah. to a staples and call it that. <laughs> but you know what? This, the, the fact that I actually did this, it showed initiative. It did. How it many did. times has he cursed so far? I haven't said. Oh, one you yet. get you getting them out of me. You getting them out of me. That's okay, cause I'm I'm gonna think of something. I'm gonna think of something. I'm gonna get you back. Okay. But my my official challenge to you, since you wanted to talk so much trash last week, okay. off of your two wins over me, see me in Street Fighter and watch me literally mop the floor with you. You got it? Nice. All right, so we're going to do that. We're going to get Street Fighter popping on an after show next time. Oh, uh, but, yeah. See, real cards, when you throw them, they flip. Oh. That one. Oh, that was shade. It would just go to the ground like that. That was, that oh, was gonna shade. Ball. <laughs> <laughs> I still win. Uh, okay. <laughs> yes, I'm petty. Yes, I am. You're all petty. So... <laughs> Uh, looks like written words count. Written words count. Written words count. Yes. Written words count. <laughs> oh, okay, so. What about sign language? Well, I mean, oh, I mean, oh, we said that. Oh, 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 oh. You got another I'm one? Them all <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait, you're going too far with so it. Gotta, Not sign gotta, language, please. We, we, gotta little thing is we gotta retrofit these counts. <laughs> if, if it counts, hey. Herb, I think you're at two now. Oh, oh okay. All right. If you got a finger and a card. I mean, if it's a finger, I mean, we just how many said have y'all thought of this? Yeah. Oh, okay. Wait. Oh, I mean, you got to raise it up. Oh, man. so you got to go yeah. off camera yeah. to put them. Okay, all right. Okay, now I got to give y'all. That's the case, then. Y'all right, can get so. all of these right here. Now I got to Now I gotta give y'all my Chick-fil-A customer service level. There you go. I do apologize so, for the inconvenience. Right. <laughs> per my last email. Oh, my oh, man. Okay. Goodness. So, so yeah, uh. Yeah, so, an uh, interesting little trailer came out this uh, well this past week mm -hmm. of Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, yeah. Yeah, about that. Yeah, we did put up the poll we, for that. We put up the poll for that, and uh, Versus Sonic Detective was Pikachu. just, yeah. Uh, it, was, <laughs> it was a cluster F. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say, like, originally, I was not feeling this at all. Uh, the only person who who really for me who could have got me to watch this was Jim Carrey mm -hmm. because he is mm. just hysterical. Yes, mm. uh, as he's Doctor, a, especially as Doctor Robotnik. Oh uh, yeah. So awesome. that would be the only part that's entertaining. But I have to give credit to win credit to uh, the um, the uh, director Jeff Fow uh, Fowler. He came out and saw how many people didn't like how the animation was. Mm -hmm. I have to give credit to when credits due. He listened to the people. He said change are coming. So, yeah. and that's the, I, th I did think the trailer was kind of funny because it, it did have Jim Carrey in it, mm -hmm. but if you're going to make adjustments to the, the actual character, I feel like you get a second chance. But I'm going to say this, I will walk out of that theater if we don't automatically, as soon as the uh, credits come up, Sega, I just feel like it needs oh, to be said. Oh, I think that would be great. That would be, be cool. awesome. Yeah. That would be very dope. Closing. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna walk out on it. I wouldn't I mean, walk out, but my That's child, my childhood petty. would be I mean, very uh, excited about that. Fun fact: Do you know who did the musical score for Sonic Three? No, no. And Sonic and Knuckles? No. Michael Jackson. For wow. real? Wow. Yes. Oh wow. Wow. A little off-camera guy uh, yeah. knowledge yeah. drop right there. Knowledge. Okay, good job. The K is no longer silent. <laughs> knowledge. <laughs> knowledge. <laughs> Okay. Put that in your front pocket. So, uh, <laughs> and of course, a lot of we did the poll, uh, which one would you rather see? That was before we knew about the changes that were coming, was which would you rather see, Detective Pikachu or Sonic the Hedgehog? Of course, Pikachu yeah, won, Pikachu won Landslide. Ryan Reynolds is, always gets to win. Yes, because I want to see Pikachu, Pikachu curse. Yeah. I just, I, he has to curse this movie. He has to. <laughs> I'm just waiting for so. it. It's the entertaining factor. <laughs> Pikachu of a Pete. <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> oh, does that count as a curse word? Oh, it's Pikachu. It does say Pikachu. You know what? Pink, pink. I mean, oh. I, it, it does, does it? Does, does that what we constitute doing? as a curse word? Wait, I mean, so what did you say? How are you? All right, yeah. Bad, my, are we? Are we being my, petty? My, my, my off-camera yeah, bad word. Being petty. <laughs> my my off-camera curse count has an anime one on it. It's like Japanese. <laughs> oh wow! And guess what? I still got zero. Wow! So. <laughs> no, you have some. No, you don't. You okay. got no. You, you don't. Some. You got retrofitted, sir. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So the, the, the comment the, section the said comments so. The you up. <laughs> yeah, no, you you in this. And the second poll for this week was uh, so if you guys saw Endgame, tiny, not really a spoiler. Not really. So don't go running away screaming. We're not spoiling the movie. Not but there was a conversation of two uh, Akabe 
with Miss Marvel about an earthquake that was happening in the ocean. And that alludes everybody to Namor. Basically, Marvel's uh, Marvel, Marvel Comics' counterpart to Aquaman. So we're going to have a, sec- a second Aquaman movie coming up so- shortly. So the conversation that's going around the internet is... Namor's wife is, is uh, objectively ugly. Wow. Yeah, oh. you gotta Google that one for. Me. Uh, but um, back pocket that we one. Throw, we threw up another a new another poll, uh, basically saying who we would choose to be the first the, to get the cast of his name or in the uh, the name or or the, he's probably he's an enemy of Black Panther, yeah. so it's probably gonna be happening in Black Panther too, and we want to see who's gonna get to play that role. So mm-hmm. the options were Brian T. He's uh, famous for playing the Shredder in the Teen- Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Mm-hmm. He was in the live action uh, uh, YouTube Mortal Kombat series. Yeah. Uh, what else? Fast and Furious. Fast and Fury- no, uh, Tokyo Drift. Tokyo, Tokyo Drift. Drift, yeah, of course. Um, uh, and who's the other guy? Uh, the other guy is Luke Evans. Luke Evans. Yeah. He was the He bad was guy. Dracula. He was Dracula, he was Dracula in that Dracula horrible Dracula, Dracula movie that came out. Oh. But he did play a, a really good job in the Fast and the Furious uh, last six and seven. I believe, or was it just six? I think it was six. It was There's six. so many of those horrible, so godforsaken <laughs> movies. I don't know. I, I, I was kind of entertained, but I mean. I'm never entertained. Yeah, those. I mean, I, but uh, John Singleton did put out a good one, though. With, uh, when you walk into a fast and furious oh, oh, movie. Oh, hold on, don't stop. What, what are you about to say? No, 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 Thing is, when you walk into a Fast and Furious movie, you have to treat it the same way you treat walking watching pro wrestling. You do. And I mean, you have to choose wow. to. Enjoy. I hate. I hate the fact. See, this is where I'm about to curve. Oh, oh, yeah. Did really? you would even compare no. that to one of my favorite pastimes? <laughs> but it's, it's, now he's triggered. It's a genuine. It's a genuine <laughs> argument because wrestlers are now coming over into Fast and the Furious because John Cena is now going into Fast and the Furious. I know he was there first. He was. But. He was. He was. He definitely was. Farfic Nugan. <laughs> Fudge. You want, you want, you want to use one of the cards? No, because they count. <laughs> Fudge. Pass me, that. Pass me that snippet. Oh man, that is hilarious. So, but, but it's it's so it's. Funny. I, I don't know how to. T- I don't. I genuinely do not know how to take that with John Cena being in the. Being an action hero? No, I'm just no, no, because I, I had. I a, think he's because uh, ter- he was from what I was. I haven't seen the movie yet, but um, the transfer no, the Transformers movie that mm. just came out in December. Everybody he's said this was guy. the best one. I mean, okay, the acting skills if you're good, then you're good. Um, he is entertaining as a, oh, as yeah, a person. Yeah, yeah. Because I mean, I even saw him on the Ellen Show one time, and he was actually really, really funny. I mean, John um, Cena, he's, he's, he's a really, capable individual. Yes. This is why I said he should be the next Captain America. I don't see nothing wrong with that I don't either. see anything wrong with that. He's got the build. All you got to do is give him blonde I mean, hair. Just look at him like that. Yeah, I mean. make him Captain America. Give him the shield. <laughs> you know, re, re-de-age re yeah. him, whatever you got to do, yeah. so on and so forth. Huh. And, yeah, uh, but now we're going into our yeah. black Twitter moment hey, of the week. Hold on, but okay. Who are you going to say? I just want to know, is the Namor poll still up? Namor is still up. It is still uh, up. So if you do want to vote on that, you, you can. can still vote on that. I'm, I'm going to put it on the screen. So. Uh, I do, like, in my opinion, as far as that Namor, I do think that uh, Brandon T would be a better option. I actually saw some other ones out there as far as um, some people who would be a capable uh, actor to, put, to take his part. Uh, one was... Um, who to take over? Cap's part? No, not Cap's part. Uh, Namor. Oh, Namor. Okay. Um, you had... Keanu Reeves was one. I don't know for me because the I only still person, see him as Morpheus and John Wick. So. The only person no. Keanu Reeves respectfully could be in the MCU is a live action Punisher. And that, it's just that I side. can see that's that. It. That's <laughs> I, I all like I that. see. That's I all like I see that. him as. I'm sorry. What? That's all I, that's all I see him as. Oh, honestly, uh, if he was to be in the, MC, in, the, in the MCU, he would be the Punisher. Yeah. It's, I wouldn't see him as anybody else. Who else is going to do? What else is he going to do? What's his name? Uh, I mean, Ebony says that uh, he was hilarious in Blockers. Yes, I he was. Like that. at Moods, Crews, yeah, I mean, mm-hmm. Uppers, Downers. <laughs> <laughs> the, pl- say, the, uh, plug. <laughs> the, the plug was actually... Wait, everybody who's in his 50s? About, everybody keeps he's talking about 50s. John Wick. Who? John Cena. John Cena's not 50. He's in his 50s. John Cena's a... He's, okay, he's, we gotta oh, look at I'm that sorry, up. he's in his mid-40s. Oh, I was about to say, I wouldn't have bought that. Yeah. but I mean, with that hairdo he has now, I mean... You might be going bald. You never know. Yeah, you seen his dad. I mean, so, yeah. so, all right. Well, but, uh, you smack your 
head like that. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it's just best to face camera front and just <laughs> pretend like you didn't see that. But we are getting so into. That's the shit out of it. I'm sorry. Oh, that's she got another you. one. Dang it. Dang. Another one. Oh, okay. uh, look, Cal. Look, Khaled. <laughs> look. Okay. So the go next ahead, thing sorry. that we're going over is the Black Twitter moment of the week. Okay, yeah. Uh, I, might, I might go ahead. What's my lead so far? As far as we're going to go over here. Okay, yeah. I, I, so. Uh, many of you have witnessed. Uh, yeah, get your trigger. life together, Trey. This, this many of you witnessed that. Uh, Taylor Swift is in Ooh. the news again Ooh. because Ooh. she decided Take she went to. Points. Oh man! Oh, she is it is trigger, trigger. Mayo Chella <laughs> is deemed Ginger Pachella. Ginger Ginger Pachella. It is. Ginger Pachella. That's it. That's the one. With a side of vanilla Nutella. Oh, yeah, mm. all that. Ooh, vanilla so, Nutella. There we go. Wow. Oh, okay. Wow. With a sliced up banana. So, you want to go first oh, or you want to go first? I'll just explain to everybody what it, Most people know what happened, but we're just explaining what okay. happened, basically. For, you, uh, for those of you who don't know. Go ahead, because I didn't see Okay, so for those of you who are not up on this, uh, recently, Taylor Swift performed at the... Coachella. Uh, no, uh, no, no, no. It was, it was the American Billboard. Oh, yeah, Billboard. Right. Billboard. It was the Billboard, Billboard Music Billboard. Awards. Yeah. Um, her performance was very similar. The air so quotes similar. are the air, the, No, no, no. The air quotes are very definite. The air quotes are there. She performed her version, I guess, of... Mm, you of stole Be- it! <laughs> you stole it! You justifying... Uh, you Beyonce. stole it. Okay, okay, you okay. Stole I need you to breathe. I need you to breathe. I need you to breathe. Oh. breathe. Bring it down. Bring it down. It was her her gentrification. Like it was her gentrification version, gentrified version of I mean, Beyonce's humans. of Beyonce's <laughs> Beychilla. Her her performance at Coachella. Um, now. <laughs> I want to say before you guys get into it, I want to say that the uh, bands, oh, into it. the bands. Uh, uh, um, uh, uh. First of all, they were not coordinated. Uh, can, can, can I please do? Because I were not, finish, let her finish. Wait, wait, They were not coordinated. They looked like they all fa- got last minute notice about hey, show up here at this place with your band outfit from high school. Because first of all, these people were in their forties. They looked like it. They looked like they were in their forties. Uh-huh. Roman. They were trying to wait. Wait, wait, wait. Let her get it. They look like they were, you know, and um then she comes out in this kind of rainbow thingy. I don't know. And it just looked really paste. It looked cut and paste together. And I'm gonna tag you in now. You ready? Go for it. Let him have it. Okay, this the whole time. This is presented to you by Big Herb. This whole entire rant is going to start off just like this. This was the equivalent to FAMU's uh, uh, marching band versus Ohio State's band. Okay, this was also sweet potato pie versus pumpkin pie. FAMU! This was was spicy mustard compared to Hellman's. This was washed chicken versus unwashed chicken. This was seafood with uh, uh, with no seasoned food versus unseasoned food. This is potato salad versus potato salad with raisins and grapes. No, cold okay, salt. no, this is this is seriously. Oh my God, what in? He's got the, another page. Oh yes, I have another page because I, I took the time. I effort. turned the mic okay. down. He had time. Okay, okay. Oh. So I'm gonna say I'm gonna also say this too because I was actually in high school. I was in the marching band. I went out to uh, it's colleges. It's personal. It is. It's very personal. It's personal. Because, I mean, when you have people that's that's actually in on this and take the time and effort to make something great like this, and then you just go ahead and just steal a whole entire thing. You gentrified the whole entire marching band experience. Don't go. Let it go. Let it go. Oh, let it go. I'm going to let it go. go. I'm going to let it go. Let it go. Okay, first Usa. things first. Let's do a side-by-side comparison of what happened with Bay Chella versus Mayo Chella. Bay oh, Chella started off with Dan, with the, uh, what's his name, Majorettes, who actually were dropping it low when, the, uh, what's his name, Taylor Swift Pan just dropped the ball completely. You had, uh, what's the name of it, uh, the drum line who was actually playing the percussion, actually uh, on point simultaneously every single time. They was on point. You had these guys like, I mean, they just what? They, what, they, they look very robotic. It looked very they, robotic. It, it wasn't on point. 
Uh, what's the name? The whole entire band uh, that, that on Baychella. You're welcome to the uh, to the actual barbecue, including those white folks who were actually in there. Though, uh, those people who are black at that whole entire thing, you need your black card revoked for doing that stuff. Uh, what's the name? Coming everything, for your head. Yeah, we coming for everything. Okay. Um, so bad. Band, you ain't supposed to smile. <laughs> Why? The fuck are you smiling? There yes, you put that one up top of that. You do not smile while you're in the marching band. Did you see the beginning of Bay uh, Baychella? Did you see the girl up there like, yeah. she was mean mugging the whole entire time? You had people like, <laughs> no, you don't do that. Everything was wrong. This whole time, on Be Beyonce's joint was dripping swag goo. I'm going to tell you exactly what they, had, what they was going on there. I'm sorry, y'all. This thing got me so worked up. 18 <laughs> soul flakes and 12 pepper flakes. Oh, oh, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Oh, oh, this whole entire thing ice. was oh, this. Oh. Too much goddamn mayonnaise. That's exactly what it was. <laughs> Too much goddamn mayonnaise. That's oh, what it was. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, I don't care. Just put another one. So I, 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 I let I let two uh two runs get in. So he has, he has the he, I got the lead. He's got the lead. Oh my So that's why I wouldn't him. Give me one of you got to pay him. <laughs> you hat, you're running hat. Okay, what's next? What are we doing? All right. Okay. You good, homie? I know. Breath. I know. Breath. He got me sweating though. She upset all of us. I tried. I promise you, she did. Did y'all see the thing I said? Did I send it to you? It was like Beyonce. Uh, um, Beyonce probably. Kanye should probably not let her finish. He <laughs> <laughs> probably shouldn't let her finish. Look. Uh. Right. And Beyonce, look, and Beyonce was rooting for you. We were all rooting for I you. I wasn't okay? rooting for her. We were rooting I was for not you. rooting for Taylor <laughs> oh. at all. At mm -hmm. all. I'm tired of this gent gentrification mm. of all our of, stuff. Of I mean, if you're going to go ahead and do it, do it right. If you're going to pay homage to it, I mean, here's the thing. I, I'm a big, more so of a Jay Z fan than I am Beyonce, and, mm -hmm. but I, I appreciate her work. I actually seen it. I. I I almost want to say she's just as good as Mike, or maybe better. That's a de debate for any, any other time. I mean, we can have that debate later. Yeah, that's We're, a whole other show. That's a whole other show. But, but show. getting back to it, Shut up, she was a whole... Uh, we can have that for another <laughs> show. Uh, what's her name? But it was just the fact, if you're going to do it, do it right. Don't sit there and half you know what it. Mm -hmm. this, I mean, and then on top of that, as people who actually took their time and... and, and and, and every single effort that they could to make sure that their show was good. And then you go ahead and just, I mean, and, and people were actually working to get scholarships to get this. She, she Not only did Beyonce get, go ahead and, and pay homage to it, she actually had, uh, what's the name of it? Uh, t what's, the, what's the name of those things called? Uh, uh, she had um, scholarships made for yeah, different she HBCUs. Did. She, did. she actually invested in it. But then you have people like Taylor Swift who's trying to make a whole mockery out of it. You got people in that, the majorettes who are actually in dancing attire. You got people in suits. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. Suits. Oh, man. So it, it's, it's, it was very, uh, <laughs> it was very jarring to watch that. I didn't watch it because I already knew it was. Too much goddamn story. mayonnaise. There we go. Five. All right. <laughs> So the other thing that we want to speak of, go ahead and take, take a breather, homie. Take a drink, take a shot, what you got, <laughs> what you got to do to get over it. Um, but the other thing that we wanted to speak on was uh, we were celebrating in honor of uh, Pride Month. Mm -hmm. Because we, like at the beginning of the show, I say, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and that technicolor rainbow in between, that means Blurs and Whiskey, we are being inclusive and accepting and loving of all peoples. Um, all peoples. And that's also why we have my good friend, Victoria, here today. Uh, so we wanted to educate, elevate, yes. all of that. Yes. Um, vibrate. Vibrate. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm trying, uh -huh. to, I'm trying to switch wow. gears right now. Vibrate higher level. Okay. But he took it to wow. a whole different place. <laughs> vibrate higher. Okay. <laughs> higher. Uh, basically, okay. to tie things together between uh, you know nerd blur culture mm -hmm. and uh, you know the LGBTQ. And, you know, there are a lot of tropes and things that happen. Like, recently, if you saw Endgame again, uh, there was a segment where, and it's not a spoiler, where one of the actual directors played the role of, I'm not sure if he's actually gay in real life or if he was playing the role, mm -hmm. but he was playing the role of a gay man in the MCU, and he is the first openly gay person to be in the a MCU. A comic, yeah. to be a comic, yes. To be yeah. a, yes. a character, yes. To be a yeah. character with speaking lines. Yes. Yeah. There have been uh, characters that allude to that. Uh, you know, there's the but my not... theory that Miss Marvel <laughs> is actually gay. I know, she a lot of people didn't be. like that. It's a theory. It's a theory. Let's put this out there. As long as they're getting the job done, 
Yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. But it, 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 the, the part that it I mean, matters on is there should be representation. It, involved. It, that's the only be. part. Yeah. Other than that, so, it doesn't matter. If if we're all in the battle to try to take out Thanos, yeah. does who you sleep with really matter at all? It doesn't matter. If you got to suck a dick to save the world. There's another one. Put another one on the board. <laughs> No, I didn't say a mm. curse word. What's a curse word? The, the, the D word. The D word. I didn't know that. Yeah, well, I yeah. did not know she that. She doesn't use it. I didn't we're, know we're, that, right? It's, we're not talking about a person. I'm sorry. If you have we're to. We're not talking about a person. If, okay, okay. My, my, my apologies, because I didn't oh, know. Oh, no, curse all you want. If, I bet, right? <laughs> if you have to take one for the team, <laughs> verbally, or whatever, in whatever way you're taking it, <laughs> to save the world, I'm your fan. I'm here for you, okay? I Look, I support you, okay? Because yes. guess what? I'm not taking no you-know-what, <laughs> okay? <laughs> All right. Okay, but yes. Fire Festival? That, taking one for the team, Fire Festival. Oh. Andy. No, that wasn't, that Andy. wasn't, that was not Andy. a gay thing. You need an Andy on your that team. That was not a gay thing. Oh, I heard about that. Oh, my God. Wow. He was ready. For those of you who are not He arrived, looped up. He was ready. Okay. I went home. I brushed Jer- my teeth. Jer- That's right. Totally Jer- That's right. Take one. Look. Jer- Jer- says, yes, Tori. <laughs> <laughs> so. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But okay. in, 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 in the process of researching uh, different uh, characters that mm-hmm. are in both comics, anime, mm-hmm. TV, I was actually I, I was surprised to realize that they they've already, they're already here. They're already there are plenty of representations yeah. or there are plenty of character representations for the LGBTQ in Marvel, DC, so on and so forth. Uh, the biggest one that I noted, Deadpool's actually he's. He's, I think he's, 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 he's gender, he, not gender, he's, he's uh, he, sexually fluid. Yeah. He, he does, and he has said in the That's comics, it. I do anything with a pulse. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I was like, yeah, I yeah, never yeah. knew, in my years of reading the comics, I never realized that. I missed yeah. that somewhere. So, <laughs> And he has like an open crush on Peter Parker. Like yeah. he wants to bone Spider Man with Spider Man. And Wolverine. And Wolverine. Yeah, I know about the crush on Wolverine. He that in the movie. Yeah, he did. I know about the crush on Wolverine. I do know by that. You know, they do have representation, but for to be on the big, the, the big silver screen. For it to be, for it to be. You sent me the ambiguously mainstream. gay duo. <laughs> I did. From Saturday Night Live. I did. Yes. I did. I did. <laughs> <laughs> I think, you know, they're they're iconic gay characters. Like I thought it would be good to have the representation. If I did wrong, I'm sorry. But I just want to display different characters. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, this we gotta move on. Come on, okay, we gotta go to the next thing. <laughs> but uh, you know, that was bait. that was pretty much. It. <laughs> and I, you, on the ride up here, you actually uh, Herb, you had a couple of questions that you wanted to ask. Oh uh, yeah. yes, for I, your I understanding. Did, um, and it's basically to the whole LGBT. That was a whole double whammy. So, you yeah. get to all so before he asked me questions, I want to say I don't speak for everyone. That is, I don't mm. speak all for all the lesbians. I do not. I speak for myself. I speak for a small group that shares my same views. So go ahead. Okay, so my question is um, as far as with, because I look at a lot of comedy uh, mm-hmm. and stand-ups as well. Uh, I do realize that there are some times where com- comics can't say what they want is because they, they tend to offend some people <laughs> nowadays. I'm sorry about this one. Getting my partner another beer here. Yeah. So yeah, um, with the way that comedy is set up nowadays is they can't say what they usually say mm-hmm. before because of fear that they might uh, offend, offend someone. somebody. My question is, as far as with uh, gay jokes, mm-hmm. uh, do you think that it will offend some people? And what I mean by that, like uh, equal opportunity jokes, like okay. uh, one like one joke that I heard before was Dave Chappelle. Uh, he was doing a whole entire uh, bit and. <laughs> it, it basically hit on every single person. Okay. Are you about and a hero new boots? Oh no 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 not that one. No, no this is the uh, pixie. About it. The pixie. This one was basically just it was even for everybody. Okay. Every single person was talked about. And as far as do you think that with some people, are we being are too they, sensitive, or is, they, should there be room for criticism? Criticism, criticism yes. in the form of comedy. Yeah. Okay. So. Like I said, again, I only speak for me and this small population that agrees with me. I don't speak for everyone. Um, As far as jokes, I'm a very, I think I have a really dark sense of humor. I do. And Trey knows me and EO knows me from a long time ago. My sense of humor is quite dark. Um, 
I think that the word dyke kind of offends me, mm. but I think because it should, you know what I'm saying? Because honestly, you know, if you use your dictionary, dyke does not have any reference to. Are we counting these? No, because this is for clarification. It's for clarification. Clarification. Yeah, we'll so, let that slide. So yeah, the word, that word for me, it's a probably it's probably supposed to hold some sort of offense. I'm supposed to be offense offended by it for some reason. Um, but as a thinking person that knows what the dictionary is, that word does not have any actual correlation to me or my sexuality or what I do with another woman. Mm-hmm. So. Screw it. Truth be told, we, it's none of our business. What happens? Right. Happen, what happens? And who I who I choose yeah. to right. Yeah. So, um, yeah. No, I I mean I feel like a joke should be just that. I feel like if you go to a comedy show, mm-hmm. you're going to that person. You're going to see that person to, to do their job. Mm-hmm. Let them do their job. If you're going to be easily offended, probably com- comedy shows should probably not be the thing for you. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? I get you're, what you're saying. You're oh. you're going to that person. For what they do, what they specialize in. Yeah. So if you are an overly sensitive person, Yo, you know maybe maybe you need oh, to find. There's four. There we go. <laughs> maybe four. you need to find another outlet. Dag nabbit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not gonna go to a comedy show, and and just find my find just be on the defense for mm-hmm. one, be you know on guard. I'm not gonna do that because this person is here to tell jokes and whatever joke they feel, they want to tell. I'm here to I'm here to either laugh at it or not, but I'm not here to give them a hard time or break their balls or cancel them. Right, or cancel yeah. them because that's their job. Yeah. Yeah, that's the, there's, that's there's there's a there's a line, and I find especially being being in the LGBT community, I find that a lot of the times it's not really gay people that are offended by things <laughs> by gay jokes. It's a lot of straight people. Well, my cousin, my first cousin, so, um, gay. Mayonnaise. And I don't think that mayonnaise. <laughs> that that's appropriate. <laughs> you know, gay people aren't aren't that freaking sensitive. The gay people that I know are not that sensitive. We we definitely have a sense of humor. Okay. Yeah. So I hope that to help. Uh-huh. But, to- totally did. Okay. Uh, cool. Basically, we're doing this because we want to open up eyes to well, other educate, and right. elevate, and elevate every that's single right. body on this. Yeah. Uh, it's not just for me; it's for everybody. Educate, right. elevate, um, celebrate. I'm not, I'm not in here going for bashing. Exactly, I mean, that's, no. That's yeah. horrible. I mean, it's be, all be, for clarification. Be this is basically mm-hmm. just to make sure that everybody knows. We're where, learning. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the more you know. <laughs> so, so, okay. So, so I'm, I'm just going to throw you under the bus. You don't want to ask that question you want to ask earlier? Okay. What's the, what's the next question? You don't want to ask that question. Should I? You want me to just go ahead and ask the question? Ask the question. Well, so, I'm prefacing this properly. So, Herb asked, and she forgot. He was wondering why specifically, and this is strictly for clarification, if lesbians... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I And it's all her, that. all her. I remember, I remember You remember now. He I wanted to know that. why lesbians... Christmas says hi, sorry. So. <laughs> I think she also said leave that shirt. She said leave the shirt. <laughs> I can't, I don't have on a bra. Oh, please don't wow. leave the shirt. I can't leave the <laughs> shirt. <laughs> Go ahead. Like don't do that. Y'all shirt swap. Hamp to my Lou. I got this shirt from Hamp to my Lou. Go ahead. He wanted to know why lesbians would choose to be penetrated by anything if they are opposed to penetration from a male. I have so two answers to that. She had some answers, and I wanted I to hear them. So I'm answers. throwing them completely under the daggone bus. I have two answers. My first answer is a very petty answer. Um, penetration is just penetration, simply that. Um, you know how you can duplicate You can duplicate a penis? Or make you it in any size. Mm-hmm. Not you actually cannot. I mean, baby oil. Yeah, the, yeah, oil I'm, oil. right. But see how you have to add something <laughs> out. I mean, yeah. I see mean, how? <laughs> but see, I can't, if when, I had when you, when you, wait, 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 but wait. When you Go when ahead. you manufacture a penis, when you excuse when you because that is that a kind of word? No. Okay, when you manufacture, isn't that funny? Because the p word was a freaking mm. curse word. You didn't no, say it wasn't the p word. It was the b. Oh, okay, okay. So when you manufacture. The male Wait, what did you use the P word? Organ. I don't I, I used it a few times. <laughs> anyway, when you manufacture that, you can manufacture it in any size. That's it. It doesn't need anything else but size and girth. That's it. When you manufacture a woman's genitalia, there are so many factors, okay? Um, that you cannot naturally replicate. You, they can send you a mold. You have to add the other part. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um for me, 
the petty response to this question is when people ask me, well, why why do you like penetration and you don't like men? I don't like the smell of of, of, of balls and failure. Mm-hmm. That's that's my petty answer. It's not nice. I know that it's not nice, but that is my initial answer to that question. Balls and failure. You know? <laughs> Sorry. Um. <laughs> The the intelligent answer to that is <clears throat> with men with men if I tell you I want to have sex with you mm-hmm. I want to do this 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 and that to you mm-hmm. that's good enough for you mm-hmm. with a woman a woman has to allow everything mm-hmm. a woman has to give permission for every single thing okay it's so much more work to be with a woman okay. Which is why I love it. I love it. You have to actually work for what you want with a woman. Man, they got really quiet in here. No, I mean, I, I, I'm, it's a learning experience for me. You have to, mm-hmm. you have to earn everything. A woman, a woman chooses to give you up, and she chooses to give you her body. She, she chooses to give her you mind, a child soul. Mm-hmm. because with her body comes the child. Mm-hmm. Yes. There have been times you probably, you know, let off in in a woman and she hasn't actually gotten pregnant. One time they can be broken, but yeah. Mm -hmm. There we go, and that's my point. (laughs) We have to be accepting. Women have to be accepting. This is the proof. A woman has to be accepting of you. She's not accepting. She's not going to accept any part of you if she's not accepting of you. Mm -hmm. Very true. Okay. So as far as the whole penetration thing, I mean, it's just that. It's just penetration. There are women that use vegetables that are in their cabinet. Wow, okay. There are women I mean, who do that. Do that. Yeah, no, I'm just saying. It's, 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 but, it, but it's penetration. No, it, it across really the not, board. It is. It's across the same the thing board. across the board. It is just, just, it's penetration. Yeah, I mean. No, so I it's mean, just it's, that. It's just, it's just that she chose to buy it from not the, not the market up the street, but the leather rack on yeah. Connecticut. Um, mm-hmm. it's, yeah, she, it's just, it's just a choice of where she chose to buy the penetration. Education, people. That's it. Education. I bet you. you, Penetration. Education. Communication. There it is. It's celebration. (laughs) (laughs) It's a celebration. (laughs) It's a celebration. We almost said it too. I know we were trying to say. Oh, okay. We're almost trying. We gotta wrap it up. We gotta wrap it up. We gotta wrap it up. I just had a few. Okay, what else? I bet you motherfuckers didn't expect this type of conversation today, did you? Are we tired now? Sorry, sorry. Oh, we're tired. We're tired. We got tired. less than a minute. <laughs> so, we got less than a minute. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, so that pretty much wraps up the show. Yes. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, just, before you go, before yeah, you, uh, any, any other? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get back. Right. So, uh, yes, uh, we do want to say as far as uh, thank you for coming on to the yes, show. Yes, thank you very much. Clarifying because this You're was welcome. an educational moment. Yes. We want to make so, sure. Can I say something real quick? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Close your curse. Okay. No, <laughs> to to out, to any women straight or or gay, if you pursue one another, get her up in her DMs. okay, do <laughs> not, do not, <laughs> do not, do not, do not. Um, for women, especially straight women who pursue gay women, because you know either your man's not doing what he's supposed to do, and you just feeling curious or whatever. Look, we still expect you to swallow, okay. <laughs> So don't think that you're coming over here getting away from something. Because, no, I'm going to sit on your face. That's my friend. And I'm going to come in your mouth. <laughs> and you're going to have to swallow that guys. shit. You're not getting away from anything. You're not getting out oh, of anything. My mom says too funny. That's it. I'm just saying. I think my mom got off the show. I'm saying. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. My bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, that's a great, that's a great close. My bad. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, so My bad. okay, so twenty five seconds. Yeah, okay, so what I got? This is this has uh, been a presentation of Blurs and Whiskey. You can go and check us out on YouTube. Like, yes. share, and subscribe. Uh, uh, yes. Cast box, like, share, and subscribe. Mm-hmm. You can go and check us up on Facebook uh, and on our page as well. Be sure to check out our merchandise like you just seen right here. You got the Blurs and Whiskey mug. We have t-shirts. Coming. We have more stuff coming on the way. That's the buzzer to tell us to get that, you know, what up out of here. Yes. Mm-hmm. So when we end the show, we usually end it like this. Up to it, down to it, bleep those who don't do it. We do it because we used to it. Drink, Drink brother. Drink. Drink. <laughs> yeah. And we out. Woo.